o'clock, a dangerous predator off the streets. Reading police announced the arrest of a man accused of abducting a teenage girl at knife point on her way to school and sexually assaulting her. It is Wednesday afternoon. I'm Brian Tapp. And I'm Sarah Bloomquist. The big story on Action News is the arrest and that horrific attack. It happened one week ago, and investigators say a key piece of evidence places the suspect at the scene of the crime. Action News reporter Aliana Gomez live in Reading this afternoon. Aliana, you've got the details. Yeah, Brian and Sarah, detectives say that key piece of evidence is the fingerprint linking the suspect right to the scene of the assault, which we're told is right near this intersection of Clymer Street and Hill Road here, right across the street from Penn's Commons Park. Investigators say they have a dangerous man off the streets after arresting 38-year-old Sean Samuels. He's accused of abducting and sexually assaulting a 14-year-old girl while she was walking to school. The 14-year-old victim was... Uh, abducted, abducted from the sidewalk and removed to an area behind a shed or a garage area and a residence nearby on Hill Road. Um, that's where the assault took place. The terrifying attack happened early Wednesday morning, March 16th. Police say he held her at knife point and threatened to hurt her if she screamed. And we did call her mom last night without giving details and let her know that the person that did this to her is in custody. Good old fashioned police work is how they caught him. Reading Police Captain Christian Rothermel says once they found the surveillance photos of the suspect, they were able to track him down. The detectives went door to door in the areas that we knew he was frequenting. We found out that he had entered into a bar and that gave us that he was bragging about having worked somewhere and making a certain amount of money. We tracked down his work location. Police say he violated his probation and is now charged with sexual assault. Now, detectives also say that this was a completely random attack. It happened early in the morning in a very busy intersection where a lot of cars and people are nearby. So they're urging people to just stay vigilant. We're live in Reading, Eliana Gomez, Channel 6, Action News. Sarah?